Babies are precious, and they mean the world to their parents. Most of us can relate to it because we've been on the other side. We have been those babies that parents adore and cherish. But among many heartbreaks a person can have, those that include losing a child are probably the hardest ones. And sometimes they are not anyone's fault. They are just destiny. This kind of heartbreak happened to a mother in the UK, but she took her grieving and turned it into something beautiful. Millie Smith was a pregnant mom who just got to know she would be having twins. This made her happy and scared at the same time, and unfortunately, her suspicion turned into reality. She thought she might be having twins because twins run in her family. However, she also knew about her family's sad history. While twins did run in her family, sick twins also did. Unfortunately, the woman that gave birth after being pregnant with twins in the family almost lost one baby either before the birth or right after. So, Millie started to worry for a good reason, and as soon as she was 12 weeks along, she went to get an ultrasound. Her suspicions came true. The ultrasound showed that one baby had a medical condition called anencephaly, meaning the brain is not developed the way it should. Though Millie's pregnancy was not easy at all, the couple had almost 7 months to prepare for the inevitable that only one of their babies would survive. She chose not to terminate her pregnancy because the the other baby did have a fighting chance. However, every time a baby would move, Millie had a difficult time, thinking about the baby that wasn't going to make it. The baby would in fact only live not more than a few minutes to a few hours after birth. When Millie finally gave birth to two identical baby girls, she and her husband decided to call them Callie and Skye. Unfortunately, Skye wasn't going to live, but the parents decided to give their best and show her as much love as they possibly could while she was alive. But while her other daughter Callie was in the pediatric ICU, something unexpected happened. When Millie went to be by her side after Skye died, there was another mother nearby who had just given birth to twins. However, she didn't know what Millie had gone through and made a comment on how she should be lucky she didn't have twins. Needless to say, this hurt Millie a lot. However, it was then when Millie came up with an amazing idea. Millie knew that she had to do something to help other parents who were in the same position that she was. Mums and dads who had lost a child during multiple births. So, her solution was purple butterfly logos. She created a sign that had a large butterfly at the top of it, and it read, Be aware of the butterfly logo on the cots and incubators when visiting this national unit either as a partner, relative, or friend. Please be aware of the butterfly logo on each cart. This represents a baby that was part of multiple pregnancies, but sadly not all the babies survived. The sign was then posted on the door to the unit and in several places inside the unit. On a few of the cribs, there were purple butterfly stickers. The stickers are meant to let friends or family members of other patients know that the baby in the cot has lost a sibling. The stickers, which have now been turned into laminated cards, were adopted by the hospital that Smith gave birth in. To remember Skye and honor her, the Smiths decided to start a foundation in her name called the Sky High Foundation. The foundation sends stickers to all the people who donate money to the cause. Having the butterfly logo would make people aware of the grief of the parents and they would refrain from asking anything about it. Hence, this sticker would save the parents from unnecessary and innocent questions which would end up hurting their sentiments. Millie truly transformed one extremely difficult situation into something beautiful and kind. She took the saddest moment in her life to make something amazing for other mothers who may have to go through the same heartbreaking loss. 